What's up, everybody? We back with another message, another video. Thank you to all my new subscribers and future new subscribers. You know we do nothing here without God because everything is spiritually led by God over here. We cover the world from a spiritual and physical aspect to get the raw, real, and uncut answers. So anything you hear, anything you see in these end times, may you test the spirits, a.k.a. take the words and visuals back to prayer with God, as there are many Decepticons running around in these end times sent from the enemy, had a strong, close, and personal relationship with God. Good, great, and awesome. All right, everybody. So let's go over the January 16, 2024 word the Lord had gave me. The part that the Lord gave me about the school systems, a.k.a. education. So basically, the Lord had said that there would be an interruption in the school systems or education, you know. And we do know that the plagues that are up and coming that the Lord has been talking about and warning us about and to pray and intercede for people and so forth, millions and millions of people. We know that's coming, but in this particular message, when he mentioned the school systems here, he didn't necessarily say it will be because of plagues. He did not say for that part. But we see with the protest slash riot slash disorderly conduct being done in universities that a lot of people send their children to go to. <laughs> um, there's been interruptions in the school, you know. They had to go to online classes, affecting graduation ceremonies, um, preventing events, you know, with all this chaos on campus. You can't really get in. It's kind of dangerous for people to try to get in certain places. So even graduation will be affected. Classes have been affected as if a plague did come through because that also caused online classes to happen in college campuses and and, you know, the grade school. So very interesting fulfillment of this this is just the beginning though just like the other one with the riots and so forth this is just the beginning of things so stay prayed up okay do not worry my children be wise in this hour then he says watch over your children school systems affected okay so just heed that warning very quick i don't want to make this too long today okay Peace and blessing. Now to the growing crisis on college campuses, protests and the Israel-Hamas war turning violent in California as schools from coast to coast are moving classes online. Stephanie Ramos is at Columbia University with the latest for us. Good morning to you, Stephanie. Robin, good morning. Pro-Palestinian protests have spread across university campuses from coast to coast. Columbia here at the center of this solidarity movement. This morning, images showing protests turning violent at Cal Poly Humboldt. Police struggling to control hundreds of pro-Palestinian demonstrators on the college campus. The school now closed today. This comes on the heels of demonstrations across the country. NYU ramping up security with a new barricade after clashes with police. Columbia University offering virtual learning for the last week of classes after some Jewish students said they felt unsafe on campus, like Aiden Hunter. Narrow doorway. At the University of Michigan, protesters disrupted the annual honor ceremony, striding across the stage, displaying anti-Israel placards. The ceremony was abandoned. Where are the police? Why do they let these people in? Protests across the country seem likely to continue. 